Hey there. So basically I woke up one day and was wondering what happens if we took out ERS and modern Formula One cars? This was pretty fun. Also only 95% of you subscribe. So please do that right now. So I can eat for the next week and like the video. Look at this. We're off. No ERS, baby. Not as si look at this. There is zero ERS available. Just pure racing. I don't know how this is going to go. I'm very excited though. I don't know when the last time F1 had zero ERS in racing. I'm going to look that up, but you guys let me know in the comments or something. This feels pretty sick. There's no ERS. So it's just straight up racing. By the way, how are you guys doing today? We are back with another video. Shout out to all the support in the last video. We are on controller again. Why? Love controller a lot, but also there is a huge problem with my wheel. My HDMI thing is kind of broken. The thing that connects to the computer obviously. And it is broken. So it's hard to fit inside the computer. Yeah. So that's why we are on Z controller. But as we go around Silverstone here with zero ERS, this is a very interesting mod. The mod will be linked down below. If you want to play it, we will see exactly how we do. I want to see if we can win this race, get some crazy stuff going. By the way, I'm slowly getting better on controller. I did kind of up the AI. This might be a little bit too difficult. You know, we will do what we do. Oh, yes, baby. There we go. I was just about to press. Let's, let's press the overtake button, but there's none. There we go. Hold on. I'm not going to lie. Your boy on the sticks might be pretty good. All right, so there is DRS. Okay, so we still have DRS, but there's just zero ERS, as you can probably tell. Um, So what I'm taking from this is that it feels pretty good. It's like a nice, authentic racing mode. I quite like it, to be honest with you. Nothing bad to say so far. It is kind of weird, though. It feels like you're not having so much speed down the straights. All right, let's just press the overtake button. Nah, just kidding. Oh, my God. Oh, that's bad. The one thing I will say, I feel so slow. Like, just trying to go down this straight. I mean, look, look even Stroll with the... Even with being behind me, getting some drag, he is slow. Yo, this is kind of sick, though. Zero ERS. Can we try to catch him? Come on, there we go. We got DRS. We might not have ERS, but we do have DRS. Come on, Lance. Give us a pull. We got no overtake. No nothing. Oh, come on. Down the inside. Oh, never mind. Bad little run. Look at that, though. We're fighting on controller, baby. We're getting better. Slowly but surely. But also, our wheels should be back in some of the later videos this week. I hope so. Don't take my word for that. But I will try to order a new one and get that going because I do miss my wheel. Controller is fun on F1, as we've known recently. I'm not going to lie, though. With me losing the wheel, I have been pretty good on the sticks. I'm going to have to give myself that. Come on, Lance. Look at me. Look at me. All right, another little update here. Obviously, having ZRRS, so it's a very normal race. I like it a lot. It feels, I don't know, maybe like NASCAR-ish, right? Because NASCAR doesn't have any of those energy systems. I like this. It'd be very interesting. One of the things I would be interested to know is, are the top teams, would they be faster with no ERS because of the engine power? Or would they be, would it be even? You know what I mean? Would there be like an advantage? Because wouldn't that, I mean, I want to be like mostly on your engine power to take you. Or is that the same thing with ERS? I don't know. Someone let me know. I'm not going to lie. I'm messing with this mod though. Th this is fun. I love the no ERS. Come on, Lance. Give it to me. Give it to me. Pause. I'm not gonna lie. With controller, I do notice I carry a lot more speed into some of these corners. I'm either going too fast into the corner or I'm going too slow. There's no in between. That's for sure. Yo, look at this little train we got behind us. We're definitely not the fastest and there's also a four second gap in front of us. So you can definitely tell who's struggling and who's not. But the no ERS is fun though. Cause like, look, look down the straight. The DRS doesn't play too much of a huge, huge factor into the no ERS. Oh my God. It's hard for me to get into eighth gear. I've noticed too. I know it's not a setup thing cause I am just using the normal setup. So just some observations. I'm not gonna lie. We might need a no ERS mode. Just not having to worry about anything. Just pure driving. Not having to manage nothing, which is... I'm gonna be honest, managing is kind of fun to a certain extent, but let's see. How does the DRS work from this angle? All right, DRS is still really good. I feel like it's not as powerful though without ERS. Let me know if that's true down below. Come on, Lance. I'm all up on you. I'm on you like bread and butter. Oh my God, that was horrible. Yo, hey, ho, whoa. Yo, Fernando wants some smoke. Look, we're having like a drag race. There we go. All right. Very fun so far. It makes it very interesting. I think the, like I said, the biggest thing I've noticed is definitely the DRS. It's not as powerful. I would have never thought, to be honest with you. Like, obviously I knew we weren't going to be as fast, right? Because there's no ERS. So if what if F124 cars did not have any ERS to answer the question, it's pretty fun. Pretty racy. You know what I need to do? I need to do if what happens if F2 cars had ERS. Now that'd be a cool thing. I'm gonna have to try to figure that one out because that'd be a fun video to do. I'm not gonna lie. No ERS feels so cool. It feels like a nice like stock F1 car. Like what a stock F1 car, what I would imagine in my brain, this is what I'd imagine. Just a nice normal ride and experience with nothing added to it. No extra power, no nothing. Just a raw F1 car. That sounds crazy when I emphasize the, the raw, but you could definitely defend DRS a lot easier with no ERS because the pull is not as much, man. 
That's very interesting. I love it. This mod is great. Like, actually, this is a really good mod. Shout out to you. All right, final lap. No ERS, baby. I'm not going to lie. This might be a pediatrician to have future F1 cars with zero ERS. Just pure on racing. But I know that wouldn't work because each team has to have certain things. And certain engines are more powerful than others. And, you know, this, that, and the third. So, I know it wouldn't work. And ERS is important. I think. You just guys got to let me know. I could be completely wrong. Anyways, I'm driving really bad here to finish this race off. We just got to finish with eighth. If we can finish with eighth, we'll be really happy here. With zero ERS on the controller. Proof that there's no ERS. You can see it right there in the bottom right and the middle. And I wasn't paying attention. Oscar goes down the inside. What are we going to do? I think I got to play. We might have to play bumper cars with him. Hold on. No, watch this. I'm going to act like I'm going over here. Swoop. We're going. Die bomb time. Oh, eat the corner. Oh, that's a Max Verstappen move right there. Oh, no. This is bad. I think he got it. No. You got us on the controller as you can also see directly over there that was fun no ers is so much fun that was a great video like the video subscribe love y'all boys